What's up? This is your boy Jocio. You already know we're here for another video. And yeah, I wanted to work on this video a long time. If you haven't noticed, I'm speaking halfway in a Trinidadian accent. If you don't know why I'm doing that, then you should check out the previous video where I talked about how I did a Trinidad and Tobago license plate uh, frame. There's a game called Alto's Adventure. And oh, I got a screen record. Yeah. So there's a game called Alto's Adventure that I hadn't played in a long time. And I'm going to turn off this Discord. Discord doesn't obey and um, notifications off. Yeah. Alright, so yeah. It's like, so I used to play this game all the time when I worked in um when I, I used to work in the Apple Store as a, as a creative. I, I have I, I've, I worked as a specialist, a FRS, and a creative. I moved my way up. It's funny they used to want to have me tell that story to new people all the time how I got there uh, so if you want to know that story I guess I can tell it um, it's just a story about how to like gain success in life or whatever so and I could apply I've applied it multiple times and it's worked so if you want to know say I want to learn in the comments below I don't know if you actually okay but the point is um, I used to play this all the time with People that uh, the customers when we were selling the new Apple TV, it was one of the premier games. That and um, Crossing Road. So that's another. I'm gonna make another video for Crossing Road because I enjoy playing it. But like, I never downloaded the games myself, and eventually I bought an Apple TV for my mother, and then I downloaded the games there. Started playing. My mother never used the Apple TV. She actually uh, got a Fire Stick, and I'm like, what's the problem? And that's a whole conversation around user interfaces interfaces and culture associated with technology but yeah I, I, found, I, I finally re-downloaded the apps and I've been getting more into it and I realized how much I really enjoyed playing those games they're really great pastime games I seen it I, I saw there's a couple um, there's some YouTube videos here and there where people are talking about like uh, playing it and there's some reddit groups so I'm gonna throw this video in the outdoors adventure I'm gonna reset my progress so that confirm reset tap the buttons in the following order. Wow, this is some serious business. Reset complete. Alright, so I'm starting at ground zero. Just for what one your entertainment and two, if you wanna get this game and get good at it, maybe you can learn through me. And I really enjoy playing it, so I was like I really enjoy playing this game so I assume playing it on camera. It's probably good for the channel. Hopefully you like it too. Llamas are escaping downhill. Quick, grab your snowboard and chase after them. So we're trying to collect llamas. Catch your llamas, keep them safe. I'm tapping on the screen to move forward. Llamas equal points. Oh, I did not know. Jump, tap to jump over the rocks. Llamas equal points. I didn't know that. Collect coins and exchange them for cool things. Okay, so the coins are so I can buy stuff. This is it's funny because I just jumped in to play the game. I forgot all these things. All right, so so the, I didn't realize the llamas were the actual points. I thought I thought the coins were the actual points. I'm glad I'm doing this in front of you all. Coins are coins are also worth points. Okay, it's just that I can use the coins. All right, cool, whatever. So I can use the coins to get. Stuff hold talking back for it. Uh, landing tricks gives you speed boost. More tricks you land more speed, and the longer your scarf will grow. Okay, I forgot. I didn't know that. Or oh, I forgot. Jump onto the bunting line to grind it. Woo. Every trick you perform in a single chain will multiply the points you earn. Okay. 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 The force shield from tricks and boots allows you to smash the rocks. Something I always forget. Don't like the look of. I don't like the look of it. Alright. 
Yikes, a huge chasm. They made that one easy. Sometimes these are hard. Okay, that's all for now. I think you're ready to start. Great. And the music is amazing, which is one of the main reasons. See how far I can go down the mountain. Blah, blah, blah. The mountain's never ending. So, you never die in this game. I'm going to fall. Oh, my God. All right. <laughs> so, let's see. Uh, I hope you enjoy watching me play this game. <laughs> <laughs> because um, the goal is to just see how far I can get with this. And I hope it's entertaining for you. It's an amazing game. I'm gonna die. I'm gonna die. <laughs> Hey, I got to level two, so I got oh I passed level one. Uh, nine levels till I get to this character here to see the lower, lower left. Travel five hundred meters, blah blah. You can read that. If catch five llamas, jump over two rocks in one run. I can do that. You saw what level I was already. On. Game center would like to yes. I mean, Sign me in. Whatever. I hope I'm not blocking the mic. Let me check voice memo. Just to, you know. Great, we're still good. I rant, I rant, I rant. So the reason why I love this game, the music. Uh, the graphic interface. I love most things about this game. It's also really relaxing. So I noticed that like you tap. It said old. <laughs> I'm not that amazing at the game. But I did two out of three. Would you like to enable games? Yeah, sign me in, dude. Like, what's the problem? Three. One. Yeah, so I love the music, uh, the sounds. It's a well designed game, personally. I think this is a game type that already exists. So, somebody, if you know what the game type is, Put it in the comments below. If you know other games that are of this style, oh, I'm gonna double. Oh, I survived. Yes. Put it back here. Don't be scared, dog. Uh, I'm trying to catch a grind right now. Uh, yeah, so. Yup. Give me that. Uh, back here. So. Do I double? Back here. I. I usually avoid double backflipping with this character, so uh, this is really cool. Cause I know he doesn't jump. Oh my god! I know he doesn't jump as uh, as highly, or he doesn't flip as faster as the game tells me. As this other character, who's the next one I would unlock? Oh, I didn't survive that double back. But I flipped over two rocks, so it's all it's all goody. Depending on how long this video is, uh, whatever. Let's see how far I can get, how, how many levels I can get in a short in a short video. There's other things I like about this game: sounds, the design. If you notice, like the trees in the front are, um, it's almost like 3D. I think they're using like 3D modeling. Oh my goodness! So I think they're doing like 3D. Elements and just placing them like 3D planes. If you know 3D modeling, like you, you can put like it's almost like uh, cardboard cutouts. You put some in front and you put others in the back, and it you know creates this like depth. So I love that. I love the fact that like oh I'm not gonna I'm talking too much. 
how how like there's a fade in the background for the for the mountains, uh, and the time of day changes. It's so nice. It's a very relaxing game. Yeah. So hopefully this creates some good content. If you get the magnet, you uh, don't have to try as hard to get old to get uh, rings or coins. Yo, oh my god, I survived. I don't care about the news. I mean, I, you know, I care a little bit. The feather, I can like flip and fall on my head, and it'll be okay. Uh, it's the elder. Uh, he chases after me. I don't know the story behind the elder yet. Oh my god, oh my god, oh my god, oh my god. Yeah. Whatever. I didn't do five thousand views. Surprise. All right. So, give me definitely give me a like if you enjoy what's going on. If you like, if you played Altos Adventure, give me a like. If you don't know anything about Altos Adventures, give me a like. If you like video games, give me a like. <laughs> but seriously though. If I hit, if I get to this next level, 5,000 uh, meters in total, in this run, give me a like. Now I'm like, the pressure's on, I can't fall now. Oh, I hit it. <laughs> well, give me a like then, huh? Double back for give me a like. <laughs> I know I said it as I was about to land it, but I think it's impressive. Oh my god. Points. Give me a double back. Give me a double back. Give me I'm not about to land this. I oh my god, I laugh. Oh watch out for that tree. Look out for that rock. At level three. I don't know how long this video is. All right, but that's quick. That's a quick one. I'm gonna make this short because the last time I did a video like this, I did the manga reading video. It was like 40 minutes, and I don't know. People, people didn't watch the whole thing. Look at my video analytics. I'm like, I'm, I actually let's put up my video analytics right now. It people weren't really looking at the whole thing. People stopped after like. I don't know, after the intro pretty much, which is very interesting, so nobody actually paid attention, so if you enjoyed this, and you don't mind watching me play video games, or you really enjoy watching me play video games, so definitely hit a subscribe if you're new to the channel, I make art videos, I'm an artist, I paint, I draw, and another reason why I like this game is because as a creative person, it, uh, it's beautiful, I like beautiful things, and so... Yeah, this is your boy Jocio. If you know anybody that likes this type of con this type of content, share it with somebody. Tell them come check me out, and um, I'll continue making more. And check out my website Jocio.com. I got a bunch of art on there, a couple of paintings that you might find entertaining, you might like. Also, I have a Skillshare course. If you aren't a creative person, or don't consider yourself a creative person, or you are a creative hobbyist, like you paint and draw, but you're not like trying to make an art career right now or at all. There's a, a course I have on Skillshare, same name, Jossie. You can find me on there, and I'll put a link in the description so you can just get in there. And it's a 20-minute course on making abstract art, and it 
a lot of people have made really good stuff. I have 250 something students that have been in there and 10, I have 10 assignments on there where people will have uploaded their assignments. If you enjoyed the video, share it with your homie who might like it as well. Give me that thumbs up and I'll see you in the next video. Peace.